In the last episode I asked you for ideas on what we should add to the game, and you gave me a lot of great feedback. So this week I'm gonna do my best to implement that to the game. Let's jump into it! Before creating any new features from the comments, we have to address the obvious that some of you also pointed out regarding what the police officer is actually writing. It's for sure not a segue as I said in the last video. To make the chase somewhat fair and square, we are giving him a segue. Let's correct that before moving on. And with that out of the way, let's see what's next. You suggested jump pads to be able to get from one roof to another. Let's try to build one and see what we can do. I added a nice color to it to make it pop and stand out from the ground. And then implemented a trigger collider and added a force to the player with the body when colliding with the pad. With the current gravity for player and scooter, jumping phase became out of control to say the least. Even though this was kind of fun, we have to do something about gravity while in air. I didn't feel like start messing around with current gravity on ground since I consider this play controller mechanic locked down and works the way I want it to. So let's manipulate gravity as soon as player leaves ground and up in the air. After experimenting for a while with gravity, drag, speed, I think it looks and feels kind of good. Even though the jump works, it feels a bit static and lame. Wouldn't it be cool if we can do some tricks with a scooter? I don't know if I told you this, but uh, I'm like a professional kick bike athlete sportsman. Everything had gone pretty smooth up until the jump pads and I totally did not spend a whole night on just rotating the scooter. Who is Euler? And what is Quaternium? More like Euler and as Irnium. Well, a new day and new opportunities. The rotation actually works after sitting up all night and look at all the cool jumps and tricks we can do. That's too much. Of course I had to try it out on my phone as well to see if everything worked. And surprisingly it did. I do think it feels more satisfying to play it on a mobile device. Maybe it's because the game has the same ratio and fills up the entire screen. Anyway, let's move on. So far we only got one level. I designed it to be a quite easy one with only two turns. Just to introduce the player to the main mechanic and also show the ability to jump from one roof to another. I also experimented with another level where you have to use the jump pads to go from one building to another. But I do need help here with more ideas on level design so continue to come up with great ideas in the comments as in the last video. Ok, I think we're making good progress here despite the total failure of having the game finished in two weeks. I was maybe a bit naive about that one. Let's address another elephant in the room. We haven't named the game. The most obvious one I can come up with is Skyline Scooter. Isn't that kinda catchy? Thank you for watching and see you in devlog 4.